After defeating the grave Thresh in the Song of Sir Sagro, Ariath travels to Ettenmere to meet King Winston in the Ballad of Bloody Bones. I kind of remember this place a little bit, but I am totally hopelessly lost. Oh, it's one of those, uh, Itten people. Maybe he knows the direction where I need to go. Then again, this whole place is kind of named after them, right? So they can't all be bad. Except he's hiding a evil chest. I kind of want it. Please don't notice me. Oh, just stop moving around so I can see you in the back. And, oh, wait a minute. You have a name. Uh-oh. He's got a name. He's named. Oh, stay away from me. Woo. That was mighty close. It was. Yeah, keep away. Keep away. I'm all out of arrows. Alright, time to get nice and close. Ah, uh, he just smacked me. Equal rights, women's rights. That's domestic abuse that is. Alright, I'm getting mighty tired of this lightning. There you go. Shot through the hide and you're to blame. Wait a minute. I think I'm getting all tops of turvy. Where am I supposed to be getting to? Alright, then why don't we go back a little bit? Or maybe I can just swim. Can I swim? I oh, swear this. I can swim. I didn't even really know it. Alrighty then. That's uh, one skill that we know I have. I can swim. Might you fine? Alrighty then. Hopefully there's nothing nasty inside of these waters, right? What do we have here? Oh, that's right. I think I remember this place. It's where I met the old pervert. I don't really want this. So we'll just go ahead and leave that there. Wow. Maybe some... Maybe people should know that, uh... You don't leave your chest out in the open world because they're going to get rightly looted by me. Okay? And then uh, it'll be too bad when you come back and uh, you find out that everything's all gone. I'm sorry, pal. Probably shouldn't have left all your valuables in the uh, chest out in the open. <sighs> Wait a minute. Who are you? I'm not the wolf. Oh, wait a minute. He's purply evil. Um, am I doing any damage? I don't really think so. So here's what we'll do. Alrighty then. You want some of this? I got some nice blades for you. And I'm just gonna stab you from behind. Because I'm totally moving at like the speed of light. Alrighty then. Time for you to die. Sorry, pale. But you probably should have stayed hidden there. I probably wouldn't have seen you. You could have stuck attacked me. Do you have anything good on you? Uh, let's take a look at what this is. Uh, no, let's go into the junk and uh, yeah. All right, you then. Well, I'm coming across a uh, little thing over here, and I don't quite want to. So why don't we go a little bit up north? Oh, it's another one of those, uh, Aten people. 
with the two heads. He's got a purpley chest. Oh, wait a minute. There's more than one. Oh, that's right. You don't see me. Oh, and, uh, oh, this is one of the named ones this is. Then it's one wolfie down. There's another wolfie down. And I just got backhanded like twice. This would have been a very great time to have that uh, little uh, super fast uh, attacking thingy that I can do every once in a while for some reason. Just keep it up with the arrows. And there's one down. Alright, this Merog. It's time for you to get uh, taken care of. With all these arrows I got. Okay, maybe not. It is. Managed to stagger him. And if I could only manage to kill it. Just keep the poison going on him. And he'll die eventually. And there he goes. Alrighty then. Oh, sweet. Alrighty then. Oh, there was one of the uh, items in my, uh, my uh, to kill list that they wanted me to kill. Alrighty then, got that all taken care of. I uh, don't really need much of this. I'm only looking for the good stuff. And if it ain't good, I'm not gonna take it. Alrighty then, so... Uh, let's see. I think self would be the best way to go. Oh, sweet ass, it's story time over there. Then, his brute wants to play, he's gonna uh, get played. Alright, you then. There's one down. Hey, come back here. I'm not done with you yet. You can't just run away. You're cowards. Like everybody else, you're all cowards. This guy's uh, making me righteously mad. And now you're making me mad as well. Quit with the body slamming. It's disgusting. And you're too heavy for me. Alrighty then. Got you. Just give me all your coins. That's what I want. All right, then. It's story time, sweet ass. So simply Faymor, so formidably bloody bones. Once companion to Issa, now enemy to the court. Once lover of Era, then bringer of death. Now forever in decay, forever cursed, never to enter the great cycle, forever alone. Oh, the kid was seeing something about the bloody bones. That's who I'm going to go see, yeah? Alright, you then. Why don't we go to the lift? Oh. I see more of those eaten folk. I think one of them's on my tequila list. So why don't I kill one of these wolf puppies first? Come on, wolfy wolves.
Oh, okay. Maybe arrows ain't the best for little wolfies. All right, you then. You want to play, bub? Little shaman? You're gonna you're gonna get a poison arrow to the back. Come back here. I'm not done with you yet. Look, I just killed one of your little wolf wolfies. All right, you then. Oh, that was some pretty big damage. Then you wanna play? Let's get this done. Just gonna keep on with the arrows. You're almost done with Right, you then. It's another one down. I don't want your crappy uh, gear. Well, I'll take your money. I don't want any of that as well. well. I don't think this is the way to go. Let's go over here, right back to the right side. Or as we like, or as we explorers like to say, to the west. Because the west is always the best. Right, you then. I see a little itten over there. Oh, he saw me. Oh, sweet ass, it's another war priest. Not who I wanted to fight at all. What a minute! That reached all the way back there where I was. It's not fair. Right, then this guy's got me all near over here. Not that I know what that is, but he's being a right, you tough, rough fella. I quit doing that. All right, then Keep up the offensive. Right, leave you see a fall into another arrow and another one and another one. And how about like 10 more? All right, then last arrow. Oh, you had nothing. What was that? What is this? It's like a little hole. And look, there's folk in here. I wonder what's going on over here. Oh, but I will. I will take your chest. Oh, you only had like simple ingredients, you did. There's nothing worthy over here. Who are you people? Finally, we found the last person we need after all. I'm Helic Cross. I'm leading an expedition to the land south of Dalantarth, the teeth of Naros, and we could use another strong back. Oh great, you're with those blokes. Well, I'm uh, sorry to say, but uh, you goodbye. Aid. You don't need my aid, that's for damn sure. Looks like you got a lot of folk around here. That guy doing push-ups and that guy sitting and meditating. Yep, you can uh, be all without me. Oh, great. Now there's wolves. Wolf wolfies are back. Did that wolfie just roar like a lion? I'm quite sure it did. 
Not that I know what a lion is, because I've never seen one before. Oh, that wolf hit 69 gold. I'll take that. Alrighty then. Let's see. Oh, I think I'm pretty close. Oh, great, there's another Itten over there. Of course, this place is called the Itten Mare. So there's bound to be lots of Itten roaming about. I could get both or one. Way up. That definitely did not do uh, what I thought it was going to do. Oh ho! Thought you were going to attack me behind with your little lightning star. Did you? That's right, I'm going to shoot you point blank range. Because that's what I do. Or not. Alright, you there. Uh, I'm just going to shoot arrows up into the air. Um, please get away from me. I don't like the way you stink. Oh. Alright, you then give me all your gold. You didn't have anything. You didn't have anything. Oh, right useless you were. Oh, wait. There's something over here. Alright, you then I see more Ittens. Or one Itten. Oh, it's one of those named ones. Alright, bye Wolfie. Alrighty then, time to get rid of this Itten. This should be the last of the uh, named Ittens, right? Stay away from me. I want nothing to do with you. Gonna keep it up. It's almost done with. And there it is. Oh, he has some gold on him, he did. Alrighty then. I think I'm supposed to go up here and see King Winston. Right? And revive some uh, dead fae back to life with the potion I got. What's around here? Oh, hello. Um, you look uh, mighty depressed there. I'm just gonna go ahead and steal from your chest. Your wickedly locked chest, because it's even an evil chest. Alright, don't want any of that. So I'll just take uh, the gold and. Uh... Hello. Well, look at what we have here. Truthfully, I never expected to see another civilized soul out here in Ettenmere. Something about the giant hairy monsters must keep people away. Good to meet you. The name is Ray Kildeen, purveyor of fine sagecrafting goods and friend to the House of Ballads. Oh, sweet ass. What have you got for sale? What are you then? I see you got some gems for sale. Oh, ooh, gems of confusion. What does that do? Oh, nothing really. Do you by any chance have a, a gem of poison or something like that? Oh, I see. Maybe I should get into this whole sage crafting thing. And then I could be able to like, upgrade me on weapons and whatnot. Oh well, have fun with it. I'm gonna go and see the bloody uh, Baron or whatever it is called. The Bloody Bones. That's what his name is. Oh. Well, this actually wasn't quite what I was expecting. For some reason I was expecting, like, a battle on top of a mountain or something like that. 
Oh, sweet ass. They're leaving me a chest. Oh, hello. They didn't even see you. Queen Bell Maid. Alright, then. Oh. Um. Well. Why don't I just go ahead and pick that? Since nobody was watching anyways. Hello there, not that I totally stole anything from you, but I was supposed to come here to um, help save somebody, I think. When Hallam told me a mortal had taken the open seat, I did not believe him. But here you stand before me. Impressive. It is a pity about Sagra, a grand hero. But there's not time to raise the king's token in his honor. We need every hand carrying a sword for the coming battle. We've come to aid Sir Ferrara, our brother in the Court of Enchantments. It is time for his telling of the Ballad of Bloody Bones. What is the blood of the Ballad of Bloody Bones anyways? It is a ballad of obsession and sacrifice. One of the summer's oldest. Bloody Bones was not always as a terror. No. He was once called Faymore, a counselor to Isa himself. Sadly, he was driven by lust and by his need to possess whatever he desired. Taking Lord Issa's lover, he fled with her to his hollow of Udua. When the maiden was rescued, Issa cursed Faymore. He could not die, and his soul would never enter the great cycle. He became an abomination known only as Bloody Bones. Every few seasons, Bloody would emerge and steal away a maiden to make his bride. That is, until he took the beloved of Sir Ferrara. And just exactly where is this Sir Ferrara, anyways? Ferrara went in pursuit of his nemesis, for Bloody Bones has emerged, poised to abduct a maiden to be his mistress. So goes his song. You will need to revive Ferrara after the battle. I can only assume Hallam would not have sent you unprepared for this task. Go to Ferrara, and quickly. When the two of you finish, I will await you at the House of Ballads in the north. Do be careful, Sagra. Yeah, where's this bloody's hollow again? I kind of forgot. Uduath is northwest, on the shores of Ettenmere. It is sealed by a powerful spell, but bloody's magic is weak. And you should be able to gain entrance. Alrighty then, Uduath, here we come. I'm so sorry about that chase. It was open when I got here and... Uh, it looked like there was a spot for a key that is totally missing. It wasn't me. So, sorry about that. I'm just gonna get out of your hair. Or your vines, or whatever you call it. Alright. Up to the north. Oh, great. I gotta go all the way around again. Alrighty then. Made it all the way back around. It was a long walk. My feet are bloody hurting. Or maybe they're already bloody. Should probably get in some new boots or something like that. And of course we have some boggets. Way up, time for the boggets to die. Because I hate them. They smell funny. And they talk funny as well. And they also look funny as well. Here we go. Alright, Udawath, here we come. Ooh, look at this. What's this? An idol vice. I don't think I've ever picked one of those. What is this? Why is it all glowing? Alrighty then. Guess I can't do anything with that. Alright, can't definitely can't climb for some reason. Didn't bring me rope. Oh, it looks like there's already a battle going on. Don't worry, I'll save you from the sprites. They are rightly basses, they are. Just kill this one. While his back is turned. Alrighty then. Um, oh, another sprite. I'll get rid of that one as well. Okay, now for the champion. But, really, I am the champion, my friend. I'll keep on fighting to the end. A mortal? Is this Wenson's idea of humor? Well, you look hardy enough. Won't botch the tale of Bloody Bones too badly, I suppose. 
Still, I'm curious as to how Hallam expects you to bring me back from the edge of the Great Cycle. But that's his problem, not mine. Wow. Well, you certainly have a lot of faith in him. I'd be like, hey, how's this going to work anyways? Uh, do you have like a potion or something? Or maybe got some magic? And you're just like, okay, well, it's going to work out. Well, so what should we do now? Let me be truthful with you, Dustling. I've never seen Bloody Bones act so erratically. He cares nothing for the story, as if he craves a different outcome. Instead of spiriting away a young mortal maiden, he took an entire camp. Men, women, children. It's mad, and certainly not part of a tale. And I thought this ballad couldn't get any worse, considering my impending demise. Well, let's get this over with, shall we? Well, that was the first I've ever heard about men and children getting all kidnapped and whatnot. Alright, looks like we gotta open up and free all the prisoners. Get out of here, you humans. You're cowards. Because none of you are going to help us anyways. I know your type. Yes, I do. Wait a minute. Hey. Okay. Gonna make sure that you're following me. It's gonna be at the very end. Oh, watch out for the bogus. Definitely don't want you uh, getting uh, bit by that thing. Kind of looks a little bit like a werewolf. -y. Not that I know what that is. Uh, that add to you too. All right, you then. Let's go ahead and free some more prisoners. All right, get out of here. Go run away. Sweet ass, they left some loot. And there's nothing that I want. Oh, wheels. Oh, I didn't even see this one over here. Oh. Oh, well, too bad. Uh, can I aim at the brownie, please? Thanks for finally uh, chipping in in that fight. Um, there is a brownie behind you about to attack you. Alrighty then. Uh, buckler of elixir. Yeah, I don't want that either. So let's open up another sale. Uh, well, kinda, I suppose. Oh no, one of the story times is, uh... Is down. Oh man. I like those things. They tell me good stories and they sing songs and stuff. Quite fun those are. Well, you should probably put on the coat then. Or maybe wear some proper armor. Wait, I thought he was a lot farther away. Just gotta keep using my bow because I'm best with my bow. Yeah, you you have fun with it. Um, they're all dead because I killed them all. You merely held them back from attacking me while I killed them for you, because that's what you all do. Well, that was a waste of time. There was no chest in there. Anyways. Well, let's continue on, shall we? Oh, what, well, what, well, what? It's poisoned. I didn't know it was going to be poisoned. I thought it was just green for no reason. Oh, great. More brownies. You know, I thought there was supposed to be like a big bad guy here. And I haven't seen anything. There's no bloody bones or anything bloody about this place. Or anything bony about this place either. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. You're dead. Sorry about that. But, you know, uh, whole Darwinism thing, uh, greatest one to survive and whatnot. Survival of the fetus. That's what I meant to say. Alrighty 
then I don't want your chakrams. I'll take this Isis breath. And uh, where is this bloody bones? Oh, is there him up there? Hey, let me shoot you first before you talk. I don't think it worked. So the witch was right. Help has come from Sir Ferrara the Fair, who flounders in the puddles of Uduath. Such a champion should never lose his way. Not in his own song. You, new knight, leave now, forsaking the last prisoners, and I will share with you my knowledge. How I came to change things. Stay, and you'll have nothing but corpses. Well, sorry about that, but you're not going to hurt anybody else. That's true. My intent was never to do harm. All I want, all I have ever wanted was love. Not to be alone in my eternal grief. Fine. The prisoners are free to go. But you shall take their place. You shall be Bloody Bones' new desire. Um... Oh, hey, uh, I don't want to be your bride or anything like that, because I don't swing that way. I mean, I don't do that. I'm nobody's prisoner. Hey, uh... Is my, uh... Invincible uh, friend still uh, alive and kicking back there? Whoa, 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 whoa! No, no, no! That's not gonna ha that's not gonna work out. No, is it? Hey, where is he? All right, you then. You know what? We're done messing around. Uh, Sprite, you gotta go first. And sorry about this, but I'm gonna totally like uh, rip you apart. Sorry, Bethy. Are you telling me that you got. You totally took one hit and you decided to kick the bucket? Is that what happened? Man, not only are all you people cowards, but you're also weaklings. Right then. Well done, Sag. You have proven yourself worthy of the name. Hallam's trust in you was not misguided. I don't know what to make of Bloody's tale, but it has the ring of truth to it. We must return to Wenson and tell him what we've learned here in Uduath. Well, she said, I wish I could trust you like everybody else trusts me because uh, you died in like one hit. Yeah, go ahead, walk away. I'm just gonna loot the place. I'm taking the easy way. I'm just going to jump off this cliff and hopefully not sprain me ankles. Alright, you then. We're back. Sweet ass. Alright, you then. It's been a long journey getting from Itmir to here. Oh, man, oh man. I am so ready for a new pair of boots and some sleep. I don't even think I've slept once since I was uh, we awakened. Yes, I am the hero. Now pay me, please. First Sagril, and now Bloody Bones. These are shocking developments. Listen, Hallam and I have been discussing what transpired in Uduath. You are needed for a very special quest. A song of your very own. You must travel to the home of Tenwa, also known as the Librarian. It is an important journey, not without its perils. Well, exactly who is Tenwa? I know little about the Librarian. Only that she and Hallam have spent many seasons studying the ebbing tides of magic and how best to preserve our balance. She is an odd creature, quite aloof and reclusive. 
From what I've heard, she enjoys the scholarly arts of men with all their brittle, ink-stained quirks. All right, then. Well, I guess I shall get going then. Go to Tenwa's cottage in Haxi. She will be waiting for you. Retrieve a ballad from her collection of Fey Cairns. It is called The Hero and the Maid. Bring it to me and guard it with your life. Its worth cannot be measured. Haxi? I gotta go all the way out there? Is expecting you. Sheesh. You guys, I, you guys, like, can't even do anything for yourselves. You're always leaving me to do everything. Like, jeez, can you at least give me, like, some new boots, please? Because, like, my feet are killing me. I've been walking all over the damn place. 